Well, we're certainly very excited to have the opportunity to go down to Lake Charles. We always embrace the preparation, you know, for this game. Um, you know, it's a big game. It's the next game, but certainly it's a big game in the conference race, and our players realize that. Our coaches understand that. Certainly, uh, um, you know, McNeese had an open date last week, and I'm sure they were able to rest up and heal up a little bit. Uh, uh, we we're certainly very pleased to be playing at home and getting a win over Nickel State, but we know we've got a great challenge this week uh, against a very fine, very talented uh, McNeese State team. You know, they opened the season uh, with a win over Middle Tennessee State out of the Sun Belt, a convincing win. And, uh, you know, I've just built on their resume. Uh, they did have one hiccup uh, in conference on the road uh, against southeastern Louisiana. Uh, but at 4-1 and 1-1 one one and, uh, one and one in the conference, uh, you know, they, uh, they're in great position right now. But so are we. And we have an opportunity to control our own destiny as far as the, the conference race is concerned. And uh, we need to have a great week of preparation, uh, certainly travel well and then go down to Cowboy Stadium, which is one of the great environments in FCS football, and, and, uh, and play well and execute and give ourselves a chance to win the second half. Well, you know, we've been uh, very fortunate uh, in the Red Beans and Rice Bowl uh, sweepstakes to have the trophy in our house for the last uh, three of the last four years. It, uh, all games have been hotly contested, all decided by four points or less. Um, you know, it's just a, a, an extra little sliver uh, uh, to the intensity of this rivalry and the, and the, uh, the significance of the game. And certainly bragging rights, I guess, for the program that wins the game to be able to hang on to the trophy. And, you know, it sits in my office right now and I uh, really don't have anything to put in that spot. So hopefully we'll be bringing it back home with us on Saturday night. But what it does is bring awareness to both states, both the rice industry, rice industry and the bean industry in, uh, uh, in, in both states and uh, for a good cause.